Question, you know, I'd called on the NRC to consider implementing this flat fee structure for routine uranium recovery licensing actions. And, and to date, the NRC has, I think, taken multiple years, as I mentioned, to establish a pilot program for a sector with only 11 uh, licensees. You know, I, I'm just concerned the NRC is taking too long to get the program up and running. The agreement states, like Texas, Utah, they already have flat fees in place. Uh, for routine uranium recovery licensing actions. Uh, can you talk a little bit about what the cause of the delay and why the NRC has, you know, can't use programs that have already been put in place, like Texas and Utah, as maybe templates for your own program? It, I agree, Chairman Barrasso, that it does seem like a prolonged period, but I've come to understand from the NRC staff a, a couple of things that persuaded me. The first is, is that uranium recovery is a pilot for flat fee. I think the agency is intrigued about the potential use of flat fees beyond uranium recovery in other areas. As a result, the NRC staff really wants the pilot to be successful. In order for it to be successful, they need to develop the flat fee estimates with a certain level of fidelity. Uh, the best way I could describe this, and, and the staff hasn't corrected me, so I hope that I'm right about this, is we know what recent uranium recovery fees have been, but we don't have a good understanding on what to attribute. If, if one costs X million dollars and another costs Y, we don't just want to average X and Y and say that's the flat fee, because what if the one that was higher had a lot of complexity? It's not going to be an equitable or realistic flat fee estimate. So I know it seems like a very prolonged period, and with the parallel development of Wyoming's agreement, state agreement, it may be that, that this pilot, maybe this wasn't the best area to pilot given other events, but I, I think the agency is very committed to exploring flat fees in a way that, because we think they have promise for other types of licensees as well, and our commitment is to doing a pilot that will demonstrate that and doesn't just fail maybe for reasons that we didn't prepare it properly. 